What's up people and welcome back to Board Sims 4. Wow, that is a sentence that I haven't said in quite a while. So yeah, we are back again with more The Sims 4. The expansion pack, uh, back to work or get to work, something with work, got released a couple of days ago and it really motivated me to start playing more of The Sims 4 because it actually, actually looks really really good. So when I saw the trailer and just general gameplay of it, I just wanted to play it so I got it and we are actually playing a new character, well it is myself but kind of looks like myself my lovely girlfriend made it and for the people that don't know what I look like this is probably what I would look like in real life or as close to myself in real life as a sim character would look like but nevertheless so yeah uh, the expansion pack get to work I think that's what it's called so I'm probably gonna be doing something very ambitious but hopefully I can keep it up but my plan for this was at least because we can actually play right now um, do, 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 find a job. So we're gonna get on our cell phone because, well, we bought a house, but we're not really going to be using it. Cause the ma main, mainly what I want to show off are all three of the career paths, which is detective, doctor, and scientist. So I've created three save files that I'll be, I'll mostly be playing myself at work, uh, trying to climb through the ranks of these three careers. So in this particular video, it'll be detective, the next video, doctor, and the other one, scientist. So I've created three sa different save files and I'll be releasing three videos a week of, uh, obviously of every single one of the careers, cause I wanna play all three of them cause they all seem awesome, right? So yeah, that's what I'll be doing, so. Detective first, then doctor, then scientist. So we're gonna be playing as the detective right now. Oh, we got hired. That was fairly easy. Uh, is now a cadet at police station. He starts at Monday, 8 a.m. Duty calls. The answer is a never-ending cesspool of grime and crime, and it's time for Luda to take a big bite out of it. Sounds gross, indeed. Care to join them, or should they go to work alone? So obviously this is the most... Uh, awesome part of the entire expansion pack the fact that you can join your sim while they're at work so that's actually the thing that I will be doing I'll actually be I won't be showing myself play uh, playing other things or just messing around with the house or something I just built moved into a small house and I'm just only going to be using it for those purposes just living and most of the time I'll just be showing off the entire of the career and myself progressing through the entire ladder of the police detective. Welcome to the force. It's time to start fighting crime. First things first, use a computer to get a case assignment. Look at that. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Smell that that fresh air. The air of bad crimes waiting to be solved by us. So this is um, obviously it says police station, Sims 4 police station. Almost looks like Russian. I'm not Russian, I don't know what Russian looks like. But it kind of seems familiar. Or it kind of looks like it. I've seen Russian letters. Oh look at this interrogation room. Prisons! Oh my god. Prison cell rooms. Got everything in here. Right, so get a case assignment. Hello fellow. This case, uh, discuss case theories. There is no... Let's do a funny introduction. We're, we're a goofball, so... Hey, mister! I'm the new guy! He's laughing at me already, like... Oh my god. These newbies on the cadet force. I don't even know the proper terminologies of all of this. Alright, well, good to know you. Uh, apparently he's just chatting with his wife and listening to music on iTunes. I don't know, he's reading his email. I guess that can be considered work. Alright, so, but I am a newbie, so I am going to be doing my hard work. I, I mean, on your first day you don't want to slack off immediately, right? So we're gonna actually try and progress as quickly as possible as well so we're gonna get a case assignment look at this three desks are these other guys newbies as well who's this guy Jackie Sims he's the receptionist oh you can actually see the occupation so this woman lab tech cool she can check out like specimens assistant that's you said okay Troy I'm done with you 
Who's this guy? Who's the? He's got a mustache. That's gotta be the officer. Yes, <laughs> he is. You can just tell. Although he shouldn't be smiling. I, I mean, like a police officer, just, just like the, the head officer. He should be like grumpy and all that shit. He should be fat too, actually. Something ain't right here. Hmm. So we're gonna get our case assignment. Uh, yes. Look at that. <laughs> Look at us sitting behind the little desk. Oh my god. I don't know why, but I just find this incredibly funny. Just the fact that your sim is in a different location like this just feels really... After considering that I haven't played a lot of Sims 3 and Sims 2. I don't think I've played a lot of Sims 2. I played a lot of Sims 1 where these things weren't really possible, but just after playing a lot of Sims 4 in the early sta earlier stages and now just being at, a, at my job, you know, it feels good. It feels kind of fun. Assist with a crime scene investigation. Dun dun. Get it? CSI? Crap. Okay. You need to learn the ropes before you can handle running your own case. You'll be starting by assisting a veteran detective with a crime scene investigation. Use the crime app to travel to the crime scene. Oh. So we got our case assignment. To what time do we actually work? We work until 8 to 5. Okay. So, uh, travel to the crime scene. This gotta be the crime map, right? Look at it. It's got pictures of the suspects, it got lines drawn on it, even those pins, I don't know. It's got a map on it, a giant red dot, like, yeah, let's go here. This is probably the place. A wise detective takes their time and knows when he have enough clues to ID their prep. Oh, that's gotta be one of the things that we gotta do later on. I mean, we're a newbie right now, okay? So... We're just like assisting, we're just gonna help, we're, I mean, I'm probably one of those people that would take initiative if I could, if I can, if I see the opportunity, I'll strike because I'm very ambitious, you know, ha ha ha, but for now, we're just going to, if, if the other guy fucks up, then I'll be like, nope, my hands are clean, that wasn't me, crime scene. At a crime scene, you can find clues that will help you track down a suspect. Investigate damaged or stolen objects and search for clues on the ground nearby to uncover more evidence. Also, talk with witnesses to get a report on what happened. Oh, here we go. Where's the other guy? Oh. <laughs> Why is she fat? Why didn't we go and get donuts? All right, so... Let's do a funny introduction. We're gonna be the jokester, okay? That's kind of, I mean, we're a goofball as well as one of our personality traits. Oh, there's a lot of cops here. What are we doing? Get the hell inside. Search for clues, yes. What the hell? It's like a stamp. Isn't that... Take evidence picture. Okay, it was the dwarves. The gnomes did this. Case closed. I got this. Look at this. It's like, like um, one of those serial murders, you know, that even though they... That leaves clues around even though they know that um, they just do it for the, the fun of it like messing uh, with the police officers <laughs> like you you'd have those certain murders like I played gotcha. LA Noir where the guy just leaves uh, clues around with bloody notes and whatever that kind of thing what I'm a bro bro loves watching sports being around other bros and know how to handle the juice yeah give me that bro juice that sounded incredibly weird discuss case theories all right What's up? Fire? Norman, are you sure about this? I mean, you are the officer. Oh, and Anderson as well? Sewell, Sewell, Diamond, Hilton. So we got, I'm here with three officers. They're talking, okay, uh, uh, fuck it, I actually gotta do, this. look at what this does, alright. Take cr uh, crime scene pictures, gotta take three, get a report from a witness, and collect some clues at a crime scene. So, uh, we took three pictures of, oh, one picture, actually. Is there anything else that has happened? Actually, that, that seems out of place, you know? Um, so, one of the things that we can do is walk towards a location and then use our spidey sense to search for clues in the area. And you see, like, this aura, like, <laughs> do we smell anything? Yes? No? I'm actually kind of hungry. Would it be a bad thing to, you know, just get, have a quick meal? Let's have some oatmeal. Do you mind? I'm sure you don't mind, right? Officer? Norman? No? What? I found that! Hey, dude! I found a glove! I used my spidey sense. Okay. Now quickly eat the oatmeal. He's not looking. He's busy. 
He's very busy. Nom 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 nom. Norman? Oh yeah, let's smell that delicious oatmeal. While the rest are working hard. Oh my god. Best first day ever. We're just... <laughs> Look at him. <it>, <laughs> We're just like, yep, just grabbing a snack. <laughs> this ain't even my house. This is, I, for all for all we know, we the the fucking uh, is this a murder scene? I don't know what it is, but it's a crime scene. For all we know, we we just messed with some evidence, you know. For all we know, he killed the someone with the refrigerator. Right. So um, take evidence picture. Oh, the glove. That's got to be a big clue, right? Who's this? Austin Slade, officer. Uh, duh, 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 duh. Discuss case theory. So, Austin, tell me. Whoa, dude, 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 dude. I don't know where you're taking me, okay? I don't trust this. I don't trust this. Don't go upstairs. Oh, goddammit. Holy sh... A lot of stuff has... has actually happened. Um, I want to go back downstairs. Cause I'm gonna look for uh, like every single area, so come here, you. I'm gonna collect the glove, uh, yes. swipe it. Okay, we oh we we just collected a small piece of it. I'm I'm guessing. Uh, gonna collect some of this. She's just chatting away like <gasps> I'm single. I need a date. Are you available? Huh? Baby? His name is Baby! <laughs> That's kind of funny for a guy. Okay, so I think we used our spidey sense over here, but we're gonna try it anyway. I mean, if this is like a, a break-in or whatever, the most obvious place where there would be some sort of clue would be near the main entrance, right? Unless they, they actually broke in through the back entrance. That's another possibility. But we are checking everywhere. We are very thorough. Dun dun dun. What did we find? Oh, what's this? What's that? I don't even know what that is. It just looks like a piece of cloth? I don't know. It actually gives like a sound when you found something. So that's very helpful. Anything? Okay. We can safely conclude that. Whoever has done whatever the fuck has gone wrong in here did not use the bathroom. So, did they take a nap in here? Plum, plum, plum. Oh shit. Okay, coast is clear. We're gonna do it in the kitchen now even though we probably messed up if there actually was anything. Uh, eat. Oh my god! Oh, I am like a master detective at this. I'm so good. Look at that. Look at this this little apple. Apple core. Oh, yes. We took three pictures. Gonna collect this sample. I'm like so good at my job. Huh? L what are you doing, Anderson? Anderson Cooper? I didn't see you find this apple. Alright. Um, so so indeed. Okay, I think it's time to go upstairs. Is he? He's got to be one of the witnesses, right? Take witness report. All right, bro. He's a bro, right? Shaquille sent, dude. Anyone named Shaquille's got to be a bro. Uh, so, tell me, what did you see, bro? That was it. That was uh, rather quick. Right. So let's do a friendly introduction. We gotta find out whether he's a bro too, because. We kind of look so awkward, actually. <laughs> I, <laughs> I look so out of place, like a young skinny boy, like, Yes, I'm coming here to work! <laughs> I don't know why, this, I, this the police officer suit doesn't seem to fit me for some reason. But I still find it rather funny. Tell a joke about Sunset Valley, sure, why not? Uh, the, the, there's nothing with bro. Alright, well, I'm here to work, okay? Oh, he likes my funny jokes. Alright, good. It's time to go upstairs, more investigating. That was my break for like 10 seconds. Chatting with Shaquille. Shaquille O'Neal. 
Alright, let's check this bathroom. So, sir, oh, you're on the computer, eh? Playing Sims in the Sims on your PC. I see. Very suspicious indeed. When in doubt, blame the bald guy. That's my motto. So, nothing in that bathroom. How about in this bedroom? Because we need one more clue. First day on the force. Yep, we're a rookie. Nothing here. Uh, might as well check outside. I don't trust the baldy. Nothing. <gasps> what is this? Oh, I found you. Is it like a piece of hair? It looks gray. Collect sample evidence. It's been added to your inventory. So let's see, what do we have in our inventory? Unanalyzed evidence sample. Five of them. Uh, witness report. Can we actually like... No, we can't. Item snack, crime scene photo. Can we look at the photo? Apparently not. Alright. Uh, I think we're done here then, right? Wait. Holy crap. Uh, click this button to leave. Work early or stay late. Return to police station. Alright. Let's get the hell out of here. We have are done with investigating. Luda's workday will end in one hour. He should wrap up what he's doing. Each day can be extended once by clicking on the event timer. Oh. Uh, how do we get the hell out of here? Return to police station. There we go. The crime scene will be cleaned up once you leave and you'll be unable to return. Are you sure you want to leave now? I am quite certain that I have found everything that I am going to need to solve this crime. I still don't know what the hell <laughs> has happened. But there's like a graffiti picture of a of a gnome, yeah? So it's like the gnome squad or whatever the the the, 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 the young crime people have called themselves. So that's what they are, yeah? They, I'm just gonna call them the gnome squad. And then we found like an eaten apple, uh, like a piece of cloth. Uh, what else did we find? A glove, that's four. And that, that, the gray hair. Did we mention that already? I don't know, but we have five things. So now that you've gathered evidence from the crime scene, it's time to start tracking down a suspect. Use the chemical analyzer and computer to evaluate the evidence you found at the crime scene. There's a chance you'll discover some information about who committed the crime. So it's 4.10. I'm gonna, st I am a young go-getter, okay? We have 48 minutes to <laughs> left in our workday. So uh, obviously we're not going to leave work early. We're going to stay late. We're going to stay two hours longer because we are a go-getter like that. So successfully use the chemical analyzer. That would probably be this. So we're going to analyze all of our evidence. Look at Tiffany Spence. Hard at work. Typical police officer sitting in a chair laughing. Just laughing her ass off. Oh yeah, put all the evidence in there. Oh yeah, holy shit, that looks so high tech. Oh yeah, one of the things that was actually added in as well are aliens. That's very interesting. Who's this? Oh, Tiffany! She's like, <laughs> you're using my machines? They're my machines, how could you? Alright, so, uh, hi grandma. I I'm the new guy here, hello! That's just how I feel. Why am I looking at her like so seductively like yeah, do you like how I multitask how I both look you in the eye and type on the machine even though I probably misspelled And now I'm fucking up the evidence. Oh look at that. Oh Do this new school logic will allow him to play card games. What did that fail? So um, discuss case theories. Maybe you could help me analysis failed failed to produce any useful information well that, I don't know what she knows about it though. I shouldn't be taking notes about this. Even I know that. And I'm below a rookie. Alright, so um, I don't really want to flirt with her. So we're just going to tell a joke about penguins while sitting across the room from her. Because obviously... 
<laughs> That's how you communicate with people. Turn their back towards them, sit as far away as possible from them. And then, you know, that's that's when we strike. All right, so um, I guess we could. Oh, there. Oh, I see. So we didn't use all of the evidence. We only used one out of the five. So gotta use all five. We're still hungry. That oatmeal wasn't filling enough. We should have eaten the whole dinner, not just a snack. Could we ask for her for help or something? Ask if single. I would never ask. Look at she's an elder. I'm a young adult. Look at that. I, I could be her grandson. Oh yeah. Gently put it in there. I learned this in biology class. Not with these high tech machines though. With like uh Oh we'll end in one hour. Don't worry, we got all the time we in the world. Well one hour. We only need one. Only one sample. One evidence. Oh look at that, it's like a uh, it's like I'm trying to burn an ant with a magnifying glass. That's what it reminds me of. That sounded good, exactly. Nice work. Analyzing evidence from the crime scene allows you to discover clues about the suspect. Once you're running your own case, you'll have to f uh, analyze lots of evidence before you can find the suspect. For now, use a computer to file the crime scene ev evidence so that the senior detective can take over. So file cre crime scene... What? There's no PC for me. Are you kidding me? Dude, okay, that, that's a PC, no, th what's this? That's not a PC, that's for fingerprints. Who the hell is this? Oh, that's a detective, holy crap. What the fuck, why does she have two buns on her head? Could I, um, like, dude, who is this? Jackie, you're only the receptionist, I'm a, I'm a, a file or paper, I think. File crime scene evidence, that's what we gotta do. Dude, you're only a receptionist, what am I? I'm a cadet. I'm a young go-getter who is going to climb to the top of the rank, so get the fuck out of here, Jackie. Yeah, scoot. I'll be head detective officer here someday. All both of your jobs combined, okay? But for now, I'm just a little noob. A little noob. A little boy. Trying to make it in the world of detectivism. Good work! The evidence you found will be helpful to the detective in charge of this case. Once you get your own case, you'll have to follow up on your evidence yourself. Uh, tomorrow you'll learn about the next steps in a case. For now, take some time to help process criminals here at the station. So we've basically, uh, because we're a cadet, we can only do like a small piece of an entire investigation. So only the start work basically. So um, talk to witnesses, find... Uh, what was it crime? God damn it! Samples? It's not samples. What, what was it called? Evidence. Find ev evidence. That kind of stuff. And after that, you'll just hand it over to the apparent big boys. So yeah. But our workday is actually almost up. One more minute. Dun 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 dun. End of shift. Luda did a good job today. Of course I did. The citizens of this community will surely appreciate his desire to protect and serve that is my desire indeed even though i might occasionally need a snack in between at the scene of the crime but nevertheless my duty is to protect and serve so yeah we earned 180 dollars but we're actually we're we're only going to be playing as work so the money doesn't matter my house doesn't matter my i'm a loner i don't have family so that's not what i'm focusing on with this series we're just focusing on, on these three jobs and, you know, working at the place, having fun with it. And that's what I'm having right now. So, yeah, this is the end of this video. Thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe for more in the next video. We'll be starting with, I think, Dr. Luda. Dr. Luda reporting for surgery. So, yeah, I'll see you in that fun one, hopefully. All right, peace.